Hi, welcome to my video. This is a quick tutorial to show you how to install Fusion from TV add-ons onto your XBMC or Kodi. So first of all, let's, you need to get all the way to System and then you need to go to File Manager. Now on here, you need to go to Add Source and then we need to put the address in for Fusion. So this is the address, HTTP. Okay, that's not working here, so I'll get the symbol out here. My keyboard's not configured properly. Okay, and then it's fusion.tv add-ons.ag. So we go to done there, and then the name, we can name it fusion. Go to done, press OK, and now we've got our source there. So now we go backwards, we go to system, add-ons, and then we in install from zip. So click on that, and then we go to that fusion directory that we created, double click that, and then we've got all the goodies on here. So let's go to start here. First of all, what I like to do is do the program installer. There we are, it's installed. We'll just install a few more other things from here. And da, da, da. Install a few more things. and we've got all the repositories there. So let's go back to um, to show you that program installer we installed. So if we go back here and go to, if we go to programs, program add-ons, and then we've got our add-on installer here. <coughs> and once that's installed, we can uh, install different add-ons so let's go to video see what we've got here <coughs> and there's a variety of add-ons here that i can install so to install an add-on let's find one that i want to install Let's go back. So say for example, I want to install this add-on, click on the add-on install. Now that's installed, I can go back. Now if I go to my video section here, we'll see Ice Films on there. Now one of the quickest ways to um, configure Kodi XBMC is once you've in installed Fusion, you need to go to the add-on installer. So let's go back to our programs. Program add-ons. You've got this config wizard here. So we go here and then we go to our Android because that's why I'm using. If you've got something else, you can do that. And what this will do will configure your XBMC or Kodi with 
the latest plugins and repositories all ready for you. Now it does change your uh, XPMC Kodi um, quite considerably, but I found this to be the quickest way to get up and running on XPMC in Kodi. Let it do its thing. It will be. It will take a, a little while for it to download and configure, and uh, once it's done that, we'll uh, come back and have a look. Okay, so once we've gone to the config wizard and we've installed it from there, obviously select uh, which device you're doing. So like I've done, I've selected Android. You can see it considerably changes my XBMC Kodi. Um, I've got a, a custom skin on here. Um, I've got some selected add-ons here that I can use. Some of them work, some of them don't work, but I'm sure you'll be able to make them work with a bit of configuring. Um, but uh, it, it's all there. And the nice thing about them is, as well, um, they've got shortcuts down at the bottom here. So uh, I can quickly, easily select what I want from the bottom. I think you can change these in the settings as well. So that's really nice as well, so I can quickly go there and um, check out whatever I uh, want to from the front. And there we have it guys. Um, I hope this uh, tutorial has helped you. Um, and do remember to like this video if I've helped you, share it and uh, do subscribe if you want to. Thanks very much for watching the video.